Hollis, Kansas is located 8 miles northeast of Concordia in Cloud County. Just outside of Hollis, Kansas, we drove over this one-lane bridge and then we drove by this Union Pacific Railroad bridge. Here we turned east off of 200th Street onto Vine Road, which in this corner is actually where my grandpa grew up. My mom grew up in a farmhouse a few miles away from Hollis, and this is the grain elevator where my grandpa used to bring his wheat. The cement slab right here actually weighed your crop, and um, right inside this office here is a balance machine, and this is would tell them, I guess, how much crop they had with them. My mom still remembers being in this room as a young girl. There was a Coke machine that you put your coin in. It was a game that I think it was magnetized and it, it would pull your bottle across and it was a maze until you got to the end and then you could get drink your coke. My aunt remembers this being the Bank of Hollis when she was a young girl. This small cabin sat right next to the bank on Vine Road. Here's what the inside looked like. This building was about maybe 20 feet from that first cabin on Vine Road and it was falling apart, you could say. <laughs> This is the house that we came to Hollis to find. It was the house right down the road from the grain elevator that my mom and my Aunt Janet and their sisters used to come and play, dress up in when they were young girls. We aren't really sure how old these houses are, but this house when they came there in the late 1960s was abandoned and the clothes and the things in the house were dusty and very old. I came to the little old ghost town of Hollis, Kansas to show my niece Jenny a house that I used to play in years ago. She thinks I'm old, so it would have been like 1965 to 1970. I was telling Jenny that when my dad came over here to the local co-ops right over here, that he would line up to get his weed or whatever crop was being weighed. He would sit in line and we would come in this old house to because it was abandoned and upstairs in the loft was boxes and boxes of ladies dresses and hats and shoes and we played dress up with those dirty old clothes for hours and hours grandpa would leave us here and come back and get us and we would just play us and our friends dressing up and having tea parties all afternoon one of my favorite memories of hollis kansas even though it's gone now. It has a couple old abandoned buildings and this is what the house looked like and you can see inside there's no dresses left. A few old boards, cracked walls, and that's the end of the memories. No more dresses.
we found a ladder that was similar to the one that my aunt and my mom used to climb up to get to the attic where they played the dress up. We were really excited to find this car because it was actually my Aunt Barb's car when the girls were younger. Um, I'm not sure the story behind why it got left here, but as you can see, it's all torn apart now, and I don't think my aunt would be too happy to see how it looks now. Once we reached the end of Vine Road, we turned left onto 203rd Street and we traveled north until we reached the crossroads of County Road 350 and right there on the corner was this little church house and my mom told me that when she was little she actually had her 4-H meetings here since she lived just down the road from Hollis. Now you know some of the history of Hollis, Kansas. Thank you.